Hello YouTube, so we're going now to install Windows Live Photo Gallery. So we're kind of, it will open up the installer. I will post the link uh, to download this installer. So we're gonna need only the photo gallery. So we're gonna check all of that. We're gonna need in the photo galleries. Then we click and install. It will check for program interruptions or prog programs that might conflict in installing the Windows Live Photo Gallery. So it installs very fast depending on the speed of your computer and in your internet connection. So you can see it's very fast installing. So now it's installing the photo gallery. 99. So I don't need this too. I don't want my Bing to be my search provider and MSN to be my home page and I click continue so now it tries to connect to the internet so after you're finished installing Windows Live photo gallery so this is what it looks like look like and you can scroll down into this toolbar around here so when we click on email it will send the photo that you have selected and so it's 1024 by 768 when we click on attach so oh, there is no program this is created this email in the computer i don't have microsoft outlook yet and my mozilla thunderbird so i'm not able to email this photo So um th when you double click on a photo that it will bring up to uh an info page. So one more thing I like about it is that you can tag persons it just like in Facebook. So we're gonna rename the name this penguin as John. Oops, I'm gonna name this as Mary and click on add. Sorry about that, we're gonna make him John and this one is Mark. Add. So as you can see, when you hover your mouse uh, over the head of the tag person, it shows up his or her name. And we're gonna click close on that, we're gonna click on fix. So you can edit photos from here. So when you click auto adjust, it will adjust the photo to its um, better appearance. So you can adjust the brightness, the contrast, and the shadows. And we're gonna close again. And click on fix. Um, you can adjust its straight the straightness of the photo uh, when you feel like the photo is not. Uh, parallel or straight <laughs> you can adjust that so we click it then what we're gonna do is close to that fix again and adjust um, detail so when you drag it to the rightmost part it will sharpen the image and when we click on up analyze it will sharpen the image so you can adjust the color and close again. Oh. Fix eye red removal. This is very common in digital cameras. You usually get this when you when the eye is directly looking at the light of the camera. So one more thing I like about this is that you can crop. Select area you want to crop. Move this selection right triangle and click click on apply. Then the photo will be up crop. So I don't know about this um, features about here above. And you can publish about here, and when you email again, it will prompt you that I don't have an email program associated with. So you can print this image too. So very fast print, 
and you make you can burn it to city or make a blog post on the internet so we can download the photo additional tool to take you on other site so I don't want to download that so when you click on open it you can open it with paint or windows media center so thanks for watching and please subscribe I'm a PC.